Alright, welcome back to Let's Play Silent Hill. Is Harry okay? Goddamn! Yeah, yeah, I, I guess he's panting really hard because I ran here. <laughs> Silent Hill. Mute bluff, as some call it. No, Alright, no so That's I need a to... goddamn bicycle! Alright, we figured out why it was crashing, and it has to do with the setting in the emulator, so I turned it off. At least I think I turned it off. Hopefully I did. Fingers crossed. If not, you have a safe state and you have a hotkey for turning it off again. Yep. Yep. Oh, look! It's Jesus! Holy shit, is that the Mother Teresa? <laughs> hey, that's my line. Not anymore, bitch. Mm. So Were you're you choosing violence already. Mm. Not even 45 seconds. You. It was foretold by gyromancy. Oh, gyromancy! What, what are you that? talking about? We're not playing with gyro controls. <laughs> uh, for gyromancy Wait, is right? divination in which you spin in a circle. The girl? And point. And point. You're talking about Cheryl. You draw a Cheryl. circle on the ground and you walk the circle. Everything. It's like teleportation circle, but way less cool. You know something? Actually, it's more like, Tell me. uh, grind. It's literally it's divination more circle. Like JoJo's part seven. Nothing is to be gained from floundering about at random. Oh, we should be paying attention, shouldn't we? You must Quote unquote, the person would repeat the practice till he evolved in an in intelligible sentence or till death flowers. or madness intervened. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Walk in the circle about? till you fucking die or you figure your shit out. Here, the floweros, a cage of peace. A cage of peace? It can break through the walls of darkness darkness and counteract the wrath of the underworld okay that looks vaguely sinister these will help you all right mother Teresa. make haste to the hospital before it's too late oh no doctor i Wait, need a doctor don't go yet uh you know what you might get your wish sooner than you think we're going to a hospital of course there's gonna be a doctor what okay I wonder if I told you there's a plethora of medical professional. It's a hospital. Oh, I should pick that stuff up. Well, you might want that. Yeah. Oh, look! The inverse Millennium it Puzzle. Flowers. Actually, it's like the Triforce. It's like a 3D tri- it's a- uh, More importantly, the drawbridge key- the the drawbridge- drawbridge key. No, nah, bro. Apparently not. You know damn well I can't speak. You try to hide it, but we all know deep down inside. You, you, I, I DM Dungeons eh. and Dragons for you. You know I don't speak good word. It's most of the time. It, you, most of the time you can hold it together, but that moment was not one of them. Dub it. Nothing special. Nothing special. I like how you said dungeon, Dungeons and Dragons for the viewers, just because that's more uh, easily understood by more people. Uh, if, if, if I say Dungeons and Dragons, they get it. If I if I say tabletop RPGs or Pathfinder, then people look at me funny. Yeah. Tabletop RPG can be. Is it high fantasy? Is it space? Is okay. it eldritch horror? Could be love and lasers. The real answer is it should be cyberpunk every time, all the time. Is this way. Oh gosh. We're yes. Nerds, aren't we? Yep. Nice. Hello, Schools couple. Schools out! I, 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 I've organized my life around showing up twice a week to do this, this stuff mm. and a couple of other nerdy things I do throughout the week. And that's the only stuff I do besides my 40-hour work week and a handful of hours spent playing video games. Oh, yeah, you could have so. You could have said shtick, bro. We know we were going to say shtick. Yeah, I thought I could go into sure. the gas station. I guess that's a uh, new game plus only. You can go in, No, you can go to that. You can go to a gas station. Or no, 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 I'm thinking of the hotel, never mind. Yeah, yeah, you can't... I know you can do it in the New Game Plus, because that's where you have to get the the gasoline for the... chainsaw and the, the rock drill. I didn't know this... I didn't, re didn't realize it was going to turn into Dead Rising on New Game Plus. Oh, these games do some really goofy stuff in yeah, New Game Plus. Yeah, yeah. Games are kind of goofy sometimes. Um. I don't really use... Like, I got the chainsaw one time, and I barely used it. Oh, it's bad. It's There's bad. A thing right there. Shotgun shot. Yep. Hey, shotgun. Like one of these games, I can I can tell you with a straight face that you can become a magical girl in New Game Plus. Yep. Uh, in no. fact, I, I can I can look you straight in the eye and tell you that it's the fastest and best way to get the bad ending. 
Yep. Recky would consider that the good ending. I, I don't think he would. <laughs> I said Recky would. Not Wait, me. what's wrong with being a... It, magical the magical girl. girl is not what makes it the bad ending. Let me tell you that. Yeah. The magical girl just there, leads to the bad ending. There's a rock drill. There's just no gasoline. You can't use it. So, New Game Plus, if you have the gasoline, you can. this is where you get the rock drill. So, uh, there's this whole... whole Go ahead. I don't remember where you get the chainsaw. Uh, I think I have a note somewhere that I did not open. Haha. -ha. I'm prepared. Hey, we could just stick a YouTube annotation. No. Uh, no way. Uh, so no way. Chainsaw. Actually, those are back now, aren't they? No. Are they? Are they? Are they? As far as I'm aware, they're back, but all the ones that were deleted are still gone. Oh, uh, you know oh, what? Though they've already the burnt. They've already burnt my trust with that. What if they do it again? So a chainsaw is found in a smashed window of the cut right chainsaw store on Block Street. Nice. Block Street. Block Street. Block, Block Street. Chainsaw Block, you know? store? So there's like, yeah, yeah, dude. Called, called Home Depot. Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, but uh, I thought they were called at a chainsaw store. Uh, that's blocked like, with a C H. So that's that street it's at the blush. bottom it's, there. It's, it's blush. Uh, you can see it right there. Outright chainsaws. Yep, that's where you get the chainsaw. On right New Game Plus. Mm -hmm. Yep. Uh, so there's uh, a right next oh, to the a... Mother Teresa needs her chainsaw access. Right there's across the street from in left chainsaw. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Oh. Yes, sir. Uh, there's this is uh. Oh my god. Anyone who knows this series knows there's like a lot of things worth discussing that we can't actually actively discuss yet oh because gosh. it's it's like like there's like thematic elements to this on a, like a deep level. And this game probably has the lightest ones, but they kind of got you kind of got to wait to have that discussion until you're done. So a anyone who watches this knows what's going on and is waiting for it to be brought up. Don't worry, I'm planning on it <laughs> just at the end. I don't know what we're talking about. Oh, wait like uh, most of the time do in most of our playthroughs. Let me uh, save a game. This game has very deep thematic elements that don't make a lot of sense until you've seen the entire story. So Do you I'm waiting. Mean lore? No, I mean like actual themes. Like the things represent different things. Okay. I don't understand. Uh okay, thing A Ricky, don't think. Thing A is used to seem like thing B because of thing C, but we haven't heard about thing B or thing C yet, so I'm not talking about it. I just wanted people to know that I know about it and we'll talk about it later. Someone should make a sick beat to this uh, drawbridge noise. But only if you use voice samples of me saying thing A, thing B, and thing C. Yeah. But you can pitch it up and down however you Oh, yeah, you uh, modify the shit out of my voice. Just use the samples. Checking I was gonna say something, a thing here. But okay. The implications oh, of that thing would be good. DM me because I want to know what you were going to say. It probably involves me, so I'm so I'm just oh, like of course I, I want, it involves you. I want to know. Oh, oh no! Ch uh, I think they're called Shamblers. Uh, they are not friends. No. They are my least favorite enemy in this game. They are very annoying. Okay, we're in the police station. Picking up some items here. There's also some, like, notes we can read here as well. Ah! <gasps> Shotgun shells! Oh yeah, maybe what's not doing that joke? <laughs> That's why I didn't do it! I'm... Mm -hmm. I, it makes you feel any better. I'm also so not cool with that. <laughs> it does make me feel a little bit better. Faith in humanity, very, 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 very slightly restored. There's a memo on the desk! Faith in brute, slightly restored. <laughs> uh, let's be honest, it's been gone for a while, but that's okay. The slightly I want restored. An edit. I want an edit of that with the Dark Souls font. <laughs> Coroner seals called. <laughs> Officer, Officer Gucci. Gucci! Gucci! Officer Gucci! <laughs> Officer House of Gucci is unlikely to be murdered! <laughs> He apparently died naturally. That's so not very cash money, dude. That's not. <laughs> they hired 
They heard seals as coroners. <laughs> Officer like Gucci died or? as he lived in leather. Looking fucking fire. <laughs> But Medical records show Officer Gucci had no prior symptoms of heart disease. Okay. No. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <sighs> uh... That was one of those moments, I think. That was our, 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 our brains kind of just became one for a brief moment there. Yes, the uh, the one synapse <laughs> between the both of us connected, and we were like, genius. There's something on it. Product only available in selected areas of Silent Hill. Raw material is white Claudia, a plant particular to this reason. To the region. Peculiar, sorry. Manufactured here. Dealer equals manufacturer. All right. You be good cop, I'll be bad cop. I'm good cop. <clears throat> You're good cop. Okay. Where's the flower? <laughs> Ow. <laughs> All right. Look, uh, my partner here, I don't know okay, how much longer see. I can hold him back. Please, you just gotta tell us where the flower is. I'm running out of patience here! Where's the goddamn flower? You really don't want to see him when he runs out of patience. I have seen him break a man's thumb with just his mind. Ah! I'm, no! I'm no. looking at that thumb right now. I see it. No! Thumb. Get, get, you think he could, get! When he breaks thumbs no. with his mind, no. you should see what he can actually do when he uses his thumb. I don't want to see this thumb in action, man. Where's the flower? Look, please, just, just help me out here. If I can calm him down okay, and I can get him like a burger or something, we, he'll be okay. But someone say burger. Tell us where the flower is. Yeah, yeah, Sorry. burger. We'll get burger? a burger after. We we'll get a burger. Yeah, we'll a happy get, meal. We'll get a burger. We we'll get a happy meal. We're gonna get a happy meal. You're gonna get toy. Do I get a toy? Do I get? Do I get the apple slices? You could have the apple slices this time. It's oh, the fucking flower. Heard right, gun. Can't see. Heard <laughs> gunshots. Ow. <laughs> Ow. I'm glad that uh, we just bust out in the random improv bits now. Not even relevant, just set a scene, play a scene, play a scene. It's what happens when Brute isn't focused on playing a game, and he can focus all of his attention on... Not improv. Uh, improv. <laughs> what on happens when you, when you let Brute off the leash? It goes wild. That's why I usually play very difficult video games, so I have to... Uh-oh. Fo uh -oh. Hello? Gunshot. <laughs> Owie. Don't hurt yourself. The allergies, man. <gasps> it's a gun. A dog. And a dog. The doctor is in. TM. Hold it. Wait a minute. Oh my god! Bro! You're dead. Don't shoot. The homie, look at me! Wait, look at me! I'm not here to fight. <laughs> my name is Harry Mason. I'm in town on vacation. I was. Thank God. Another human being. Do you work here? I'm Dr. Michael Kaufman. I work at this hospital. So maybe you can tell me what's going on. I really can't say. I was taking a nap in the staff room. When I woke up, it was like this. It's a long nap, bro. Everyone seems to have disappeared. Is he taking a And it's snowing out. Dirt this nap? time of year. Something's nah, I think that's probably wrong. legit. My understanding disappeared is this time of year. Those monsters. Hospital doctors will just crash for like as long as they can. Aberrations. That's true. Every they have like rooms dedicated to it apparently. Mm-hmm. You and yeah, I both know creatures like that too. don't exist. Like medication. Correct. Yeah. And patients. And janitorial equipment. Have you seen a little girl in That's the makeout closet. I'm looking for my daughter. Don't tell that. She's only seven. Short, black hair. They all know. She's missing. I'm sorry. They've all watched Grey's Anatomy. But with all those monsters around, I highly doubt that she's... Sorry, I didn't mean to alarm you. Your wife, she's here with you. My she what? She died four years ago. Now it's my just wife? me and my daughter. <laughs> what, you mean to tell me I've been married this whole time? Sorry. Well, I'd better be going. Okay, bye. I can't just sit around here doing nothing. So long. Good luck out there. The doctor is out. 
I, I do want to just take a second and acknowledge that I, I I'm always vaguely impressed with myself when I pull off a, when I when I go on that tangent like that cop thing for like multiple minutes because I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> I've never I've never mm. like like had in each in like direction. I just pull shit out of my ass for 10 minutes at a time. Some people would call that a special skill you could get paid for. Damn, that's crazy. No, would, pulling, would, pulling objects out of your ass. Oh. I thought you were going to say <laughs> wit or, or something. Well, I can't be giving you too much credit now. On okay. screen. Okay. There is a uh, newspaper. This article has been article. clipped out. <laughs> what, which article? I which don't article? know. <laughs> oh. There's another room I can go into. Yeah. I was going to say, it's it's almost like I'm going to go to school for something where I could put that kind of special skill to use so that you Kitty. just, you, you turn it around on me before I had the chance, and now I'm sad. It's like I've been trained on how to think a few steps ahead in, min in moments like this. Nothing unusual. I disagree. I mean, I find that this whole like situation a thingy. quite no. peculiar. I'm sorry. Can, Apparently, uh, can you, can you go back the and look at are still gone. It's, it's just yeah, like... one second. One second. Hey. Just, just look at the book for a second. Uh, which I don't, book? I, I, I don't care which one. Ah, uh, kitty. Hold on. <laughs> what am I supposed to hold on to? Okay. <laughs> Fuck. Do, 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 do. Damn, that was good. <laughs> it was for me. I don't even care. That was just for me. <laughs> I needed this. Yeah, um, the, uh, the YouTube annotations thing. It's like people, oh. including me, were seeing a button for turning annotations on and off after that sometime like way after they discontinued it but i think it was a bug or something i don't know but uh what's wild is that apparently you can get a browser extension that actually brings them back so i guess all of the data for the annotations still exists classic love that i can go back to 2008 era youtube classic youtube Speaking of classic YouTube. YouTube, shout out to the people leaving comments on like three year old Let's Plays. We love that. I love that. Yeah. It makes me feel good. I get, I get all warm and fuzzy inside and that that, that, that confuses me. It's some it's it's not an uh, often occurrence for him, so he really appreciates it. You hear how Hyper talks to me all the time and then I see a compliment in the comments and I start <laughs> crying. Yeah. Is there a... No, nope. my, 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 I was at work and my boss asked me if I'm okay one day and I was just like, I'm going to cry. This, this, this squirrel man talks funny to me <laughs> twice a week. Yeah. But he keeps coming back for more. You can't get rid of me. God damn it. I'm not trying to. I don't believe you. <laughs> <laughs> my plan is working. Wait, is this the... Oh yeah, we've been in here. Duh. I got distracted by the kitty. That's that's a reasonable distraction. Ooh, the kitchen. The kitchen. I uh, I, I was looking back at that 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 uh, the grudge, the Resident Evil 3 grudge match. A hundred and eighty-three times I died. That's oh. insane. That is. Wait, I remember way. that. That was three years ago. That was three years ago. Oh, now, that oh. one might have only been. That one was probably a year ago. There okay. was something that was. Th I, I think it was just Resident Evil Three. They got. Ah. Oh. A pool of. It's just funny. Something. Like glass vial lies shattered. It's not just broken. It looks smashed on purpose. Ah! Oh, I cut my hand on glass. That's a lot of blood. <laughs> okay, DiCaprio. 
I was yeah. I stand corrected. It was a it's a year ago. Now what do we have here? Time just flies when, when you're having a grudge. So grudge against ninety percent of there a we series. Go. Red liquid found in a broken vial in the hospital director's room. <laughs> I'm sure it's, that won't be relevant. <laughs> it's, it's iodine. Ooh, the basement key. The base. I don't think there's anything down here yet. But let's go ahead and check. For the final boss. Exploration. Oh. Ah. Ah. Yikes. The roaches. They're out of hand. I believe those are called creepers. Those aren't explodey things from Minecraft. Oh. Minecraft stole. All the good things steal. It's the mark of a good artist. And one of the first times I've heard something named Creeper was friggin' like the... What, like the 60s Scooby-Doo? Yeah. Creeper! Paper! In-house generator powers elevators, ICUs, and operating rooms only. Do you want to press the switch? Oh, yes. What kind of a question is that? Okay, yeah, I, I think... definitely had to say that with a question mark because they were still airing that cartoon when I was a kid, so I'm not the as familiar with when it was like came out. The original yeah. Scooby Doo was the sixties. Yeah. It was like the late sixties. Mm-hmm. Uh still seven to me. nine, I think. And yeah, no, I like the original Scooby Doo. I'm also partial to what's new Scooby Doo. We're coming oh. after you. you. Gotta <laughs> solve that mystery. mystery. What's your Scooby? Na 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 na. Okay. Okay. I was a little off on that note. I liked Mystery Incorporated. That, that was the newer one, right? Where they had like an actual plot. Yeah, an overarching plot. That was a good show too, mm. surprisingly. Okay. Is that the one with Ultra Instinct Shaggy. That's that's where that meme. Uh, that's where a lot of the pictures of that meme come. Oh. From. Yeah. Uh, no, that. Oh, Ultra suddenly the Shaggy meme floor. comes from uh, one of the movies. Suddenly there's a fourth floor. Suddenly there's a fourth floor. Uh, one of the floor. best, one, one of the best scares in the game that I completely ruined by start this, by like continuing this Scooby Doo kit uh, tangent. I saw a meme where the Mystery Machine and the uh, Impala from Supernatural were parked outside a building, and they were like, "Oh, so this place is that haunted?" It's from an actual crossover. Yeah, Scooby Doo has some wild, wild crossovers. I think the Supernatural one's the funniest. Like the funniest idea. Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh. Uh oh. We're in spooky hospital. It's locked! Ooh. And all these doors uh, are jammed, so we're just not gonna check. Lone Star. I don't think the doctor's been in this side of the building for a while. Oh no! Unless it's a different kind It's locked! Doctor. Doors keep locking. It's very scary. It is. Sh shaking in my boots. I right am shooketh. Yeah, that's the one. Uh, Scooby Doo Legend of the Phantasaur is a movie where Shaggy just freaking beats up a gang of bikers, literally. There's a. There's a. Uh, yeah, here's your plethora of medical professional. Also known as one of the biggest pains in the ass in this game. Nurse, please, no. Uh, note the parasite wiggling on her back. Oh, yeah. Like, even though she's, like, dead. Well. There we go. It's still well. Now it's not wiggling, but it was right after. Right after she dies. Yeah. It it was undulating. Yep. Plate of turtle. Which one? Uh, what the hell was that? Uh, so there's a Scooby. There's a Scooby Doo movie. There's a couple, but there's one one in particular where uh, the WWE wrestler John mm -hmm. Cena jumps in front of a rolling boulder to save the Mystery Inc. kids, and his actual literal theme music plays in the movie when he jumps to save these kids as he catches this boulder. And it is hysterical. That's when you know he's being serious. Uh, I don't know who is or isn't familiar with the John Cena theme, but uh, it's it's not exactly the kind of thing you would expect to hear in, in a Scooby-Doo movie. 
put it that way. But you know what? His name is John Cena. I think we've, at this point in time, we've reached a point where, like, Scooby-Doo almost has no fixed definition of what it is. I, I disagree. I think there is a definitive, like, vibe to Scooby-Doo. Yeah. And the things that don't meet that vibe are kind of just bad. Now, there can be changes to the vibe in, like, certain ways. But there's, like, a core vibe that a lot of the good stuff met. Mm. Yes. More rooms I need to check That's out. Fair, but if if you're not separating it from like what was actually good and worked, to like if you're just looking at what they were willing to put out, they, it's like they'll freaking do anything with the property. Apparently, okay. anything to make a quick buck. Yeah, they make a quick buck, and I I make a very slow, painful buck. Uh... VCR. It's old but usable. It, it's true. It's, that's gonna. I'm gonna say that sounds like most VCRs nowadays. That's just correct. Yep. I don't know if I've ever mentioned it, but I've got a VHS of Sonic the Hedgehog movie sitting next to me, and it's sat next to me for approximately 20 years. That's <laughs> the G. Leo White one. Yeah. Oh. Nice. Nurse, I'm sorry, but it's time to shift over to the night Ow. shift. Ow. Joke's on oh, you. Like night I'm... shift. Joke's on you. She's on a 36-hour shift. No! She's Fine. getting that yeah, that's overtime why... pay. That's why double shifting doesn't happen, because double shifting as a nurse would literally mean working over 24 hours straight. <laughs> it's well, true. It's, it's absurd. Not good. It's not good. I'm... I... Uh, I... A standard shift is 12 hours, but it's not actually 12 hours because once your shift is quote unquote over, you still have to spend extra time doing stuff like charting. Do you got to chart? If there's an yeah. emergency with a patient and you're there, you're just there now. Mm -hmm. uh, if anything happens and you just happen to be in the area, you're there now. Yep. Oh, your replacement came in? Great. That means you can help them. Start shit. I dropped out of nursing school for a reason. <laughs> I got a buddy in nursing school right now. I have uh, not seen him. One of my mm. family members just graduated from nursing he, school. If you're in nursing school, you don't exist anymore. That's <laughs> facts. Those are the rules. Oh. Yo, I wish are there just back. not enough people taking up the profession? Because I would feel uh, like it would a lot be of better to just hire people for the, eight-hour uh, shifts. <laughs> it's it's oh, not an easy profession. It's a lot like teaching, where it's like... They get paid pretty well, comparatively, and it's still not really worth it. And there's not like a ton of people taking up the profession. Uh, more and a people. A lot of people left recently due to. Uh, good. Open yeah. All right. Yeah. During the uh, they just had a max exodus, and uh, a lot of a lot of it's also like people want. Uh, they, that's, there's like a prevailing thought where if you're not gonna be a doctor, then you're not. It's not worth it. Even though which is which is way harder way harder and way more integral mm. to the day-to-day -day livelihood of an individual in medical care yeah, yeah i i did kind of get to see the results of that exodus as well uh anyone who's I, any, anyone i think who spent even more than a day in a hospital like has been done like an inpatient stay at a hospital would be able to tell you the value a nurse brings to your stay yeah a but good nurse yeah. A good nurse does wonders for patients. Okay. Uh, and a bad and a bad nurse usually uh, means you're gonna have one of the worst days of your life. <laughs> yep. <laughs> they have a lot of power over you. All right. Uh, when I was, I I did. Uh, it was like four or five I days. I did here. in the hospital after my surgery, and there was one night where yes. they the nurse would refuse to give me any pain medications, and it was one of the most miserable experiences of my adult life. That, I don't think that's the nurse's oh. decision. It so the paperwork, my medical chart said every eight hours they were able to give me, if I request it, pain medications. I requested it twice over that day, and got it neither time. That's the hell. Because the I, nurse I ran is into issues with that, but it was at least on like the like oh. level of what the doctors wanted to do with it. The doctor said, "Fuck you." The doctors Grim gave me like, list. 
the doctors gave me like a you know like they gave me a chart and the chart says because i just got out of surgery so i have like a, a list of medicaid antibiotics and if he's in pain you give him this and blah 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 and i don't remember if it was actually eight hours or six hours or whatever but i the point is she got there in the morning and i asked hey i just woke up my tummy hurt they took an organ out can i have like a pill or something she said uh she said maybe after breakfast and i said okay i can wait and then after breakfast came and i asked and she said no and just walked away and i asked one more time and then eventually my mother called the hospital complained and a different nurse came in and gave me medication and i never saw that nurse again the mm -hmm. one who oh, yeah. denied me medication <laughs> so wonder, yeah um, it shout I out to mom probably, no joke i probably wouldn't be here if i hadn't had someone to advocate for me it's like you need that sometimes mm -hmm. oh 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 no, no. I, the wall I, tentacles you gotta watch uh, out for those I'm being generous saying probably. I can actually just say 100%. <laughs> like, yeah, I was just in pain. I can't imagine when I got denied medications that would, like, save my life. Um, but, uh, yeah, no, I, I feel like there should be a system in place where a third party not affiliated with a hospital has people in with like a list of people they advocate for or something like third party advocates who are aware of like go? let's see who are aware of like the way medic medicines are like like third party like, nurses who can yeah. like advocate for a patient when a hospital's nurse isn't doing something the, the way like they should be a medical attorney yeah so if someone doesn't have a really pissed off mother like I did or anything else excuse me mm -hmm. uh they could have a really pissed off medical attorney to be like hey <laughs> you, this says every eight hours they could have pain meds they asked for me pain tap meds. sign i'll it's tap like... this fucking side where room i missed let's see do i have all the plates one two i'm missing a plate hmm I wish I could help, but I can't. Hmm. I'll throw out one, uh, like one of my stories, like short, a short one of my stories. I guess, like you all know how messed up my stomach was, right? Yes. Yes. And uh, I almost got kicked out of the hospital because I uh, didn't drink like a gallon of uh, a thing that was basically meant to act as like a laxative uh, before like a, a scan. Sure. Uh, mm -hmm. that, that's a lot of fluid to drink in just like, what, a few hours or something? Especially yeah. when and when your stomach is like completely just gone. I, mean, they're just and I almost got kicked out of the hospital because I didn't do it and they're like, oh, you're not trying. Uh, so Because I only managed to drink as much as I managed to, which was not anywhere near the whole thing. I have like an opposite story kind of they wanted me to drink uh like the isotope for scans uh or not sorry not the isotope you eat the isotope they wanted me to drink that shit basically but like a smaller uh, dosage uh, barium contrast kind of thing yeah yeah bro yeah, that's stuff you i had no, no issue with they want uh, you to drink an entire jug of milk yeah they, they do expect you to do that uh sometimes the thing Wait, i had what? to drink like a, i'm trying to figure gallon. out how much a gallon is a gallon is a jug of milk yeah Oh, that's what they wanted me to drink of, like, the laxative stuff. Yeah, it was called Go Lightly or something. It's like, uh, a little more than, um, it's like, uh, four liters, Reki. Yeah, a jug of milk. I, I had to drink, uh, something that was one-fourth of, you know, one-fourth of that, uh, when I was yeah. in the hospital one time, uh, to do a scan of my, my tummy, and, um, mm. and, uh, this is when I was when I was really sick with my stomach, and I was that's when I lost forty pounds over uh, being sick. Hey, hell yeah! Uh, hell yeah! And I lost twenty more. One seventy seven, <laughs> baby. Let's go. Uh, yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> uh, that's extra. The last forty pounds is exercise. I'm healthy now. We're good. Um, right. but, but I drank that shit, and I was, since I was so sick, I was throwing up all the time. I drank it, and I threw it back up. But I didn't just puke. I said I'm going to puke. The nurse 
kicked, like, tried to kick a trash can towards me and stepped aside. And I coded the fucking room. They had to move me to a different room. <laughs> and when they put me into, when they put me in for an extended stay the next, like, hour, the nurses the next day were like, are you the guy who coded room 108? <laughs> 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 I'm still. I, 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 yeah, that was me. I owned up to it. I was like, yes, I coded room 108. Doctor, uh, I don't think that knife is sanitary. He's a, he's a legend. It can't be used for surgery. I'm still known as that guy who coded room 108 in that hospital. There are some I'm nurses mostly... who look at me and are like, oh, you're you're, you're 108 guy, and I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I, I mostly just didn't have around. issues just drinking like the contrast, but there but there was one time when I was particularly not doing well where like. I, I could it, I could tell it was a lot much for me, and I, I did my best. I think I managed to drink all of it, but then by the time we were like in the scan room, I just like uh, I think I think I might have warned them, but I don't know. I just like there wasn't even a, there wasn't really a trash can anywhere nearby, so just like I had no choice. I couldn't hold it in, so it went on the floor, and they were they were very nice about it. I felt really bad, but yeah. Oh, they're used to it. They've seen so much worse. They saw worse than that in their residency. I know that for a fact because I've taken that <laughs> residency and it sucks. Oh man. My favorite thing to there joke with is. people about my my CNA residency oh, is: Do you know how many times my ass got grabbed by old people? All the time. Rock mm -hmm. On the daily. And don't let them being old fool you. They have a grip like no one would believe. He was banging on the door. Let me into my office, please. Doctor, this isn't your patient's room! It's not 108! You're not allowed access to room 106! Oh look, more stairs. But that's like a case of like, what are you really gonna do? Because they live there, and most of them live there like... By, by way of the state, so what are you gonna do? <laughs> Kick him out? Yikes. You're talking about the elderly people. The elderly uh. people who groped my ass, yes. I'm just confirming for our viewers, because we talked, we threw a couple of things in between there, and they might have lost track of the conversation. Yeah, no, no, no. I, I met the elderly people who are inappropriate in the nursing homes, but it's like, a lot of them are, are basically wards of the state by that point. Because they're in some way unwell and oh, can't just like put them on the street. <sighs> eh. See, this is what they do when there's two of them. They they grab you so the other one can just. Oh. Can come up and just stab. That's very rude. Yep. Oh, turn around, Harry. Stop. Don't grab the patients. <sighs> I knew I Ow. shouldn't have eaten the soup at the cafeteria. Knock Cheryl. it off. Oh, yeah, having having Can't played it recently, I can see what people were talking about with like Silent Hill 2 being a lot easier. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The Silent Hill 1's hard. Coming in here was not worth it. Well, you used a health drink but got one back, so it was a net. Wasn't there another item over there? No. <laughs> Pipe is my favorite weapon. Oh, ampule. Oh, yeah, there's, a, there's an ampule. Ooh. An ampule. Well, there is a... There's another weapon around here somewhere that I want to get. At least I think it's, it's here. A batter, it's a battering ram. I think it's in the storeroom. It's a battering ram. <sighs> it's not a battering ram. It's not, it's not a battering ram. Generator room? Maybe it's in the generator room. Also, kids, make sure when you leave the morgue, you wash your hands. Otherwise, you're going to kill everyone in the hospital. Oh, there it is. A hammer. Sledgehammer! I do not like this weapon. You don't? Oh. No, I like the pipe. 
You can use whatever you want. Really, really slow. It's very slow, yes. Uh, uh, yeah. I, I, I prefer the the combo of left right that the pipe does, and then I, occasionally goes for the downward sw swing. Doesn't this do the same thing? Yeah, but it's slow. Okay. Bang bang, Harry's ball pin hammer fell down on the zombies. All right. Grab it apart. So, I mean, you could use the weapon here. Like, yeah, you, you, if you, it works you, well you, for you, you should use it. I'm just talking about my experience. You use whatever floats your boat. What, 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 what Brute prefers doesn't fucking matter. Bruce, I played the game. That's correct. <laughs> so sit down. I am sitting. Good. Um. All right. Let's see if we can go. Am I, am I supposed to stand when we do these? I used to. I know. It was a mistake. You no longer stand. I sometimes stand. You will not stand for this. I'll stand I'm, for I'm, I'll stand for Silent Hill. I'm, I'm <sighs> currently sitting, but St Silent Hill is pretty cool. I'm standing. I'm now standing. Good for you. Yeah, Do that's. You I'm not. I'm not gonna stand. My room is 82 degrees. <laughs> oh no. Yikes. I know. I, I I've become I'm conditioned. I'm right across the hall from you. I've become conditioned to do it because I work outside with the dog uh, with dogs a lot. Uh, and I just wear a sweat. I wear a sweater all the time. D a w g. Yeah, it's dogs. I, I stuttered because I was like, "Do I want to say that?" And then I was like, "Well, I've already said it, so here we go." <laughs> okay. Don't worry. I oh. Oh. That's right. Puzzle. Clouds Cloud. flowing. Oh no, you go. Clouds oh. flowing over a hill. Sky on a day. Tangerines there. Lucky. Clover. Violet Cinnabar. Dandelions along a path. Avoidable sleeping time. <clears throat> Liquid flowing from a slashed wrist. Lovely. But yeah, that, that was a moment of like, am I revealing too much personal information with the sentence? And then, nah. Just a uh, color puzzle with the plates that we picked up. So we have to... Dandelions, violets, yep. blood. And the, the note just tells us the order it needs to go in. The cow is one of his milk. And I'm assuming it's going in <clears throat> clock clockwise, because, you know, clouds. Yeah, clouds and the clouds being the clouds. Top right, and yeah, you go blood in the top left. I believe you're correct. Yep. Clouds and squalls. Green and... <laughs> Violets in the garden. Hey! Yay! Yeah, kitty! This no, that's, was... a, that's a nurse. No, kitty's crawling on me. <laughs> no. Oh. I'm currently playing with one hand. Yep. Oh. Will you? Oh my god! All right. Seems pretty good to me. <laughs> uh huh. That went pretty well. Oh. I can't get the timing down. Oh. All right. Sounds like user error. <sighs> Anybody else? Uh, so yeah, not saying I would be any better because I've never played this game. No, it's fine. Okay. My only problem is I can't move while I'm using uh, melee weapons. The AI, uh, my the the benefit is that the AI is very uh... silly. Ow! Silly, yeah. Um, very rudimentary. 
directable. Ah. You can kind of uh, get them to do what you want them to do, and. What there was an item in here? Nope. Doesn't look right. Come on. Come oh. hither. Ah! I'll take that. The zoom tight. Ugh! I didn't even save! Uh. Yeah, let's check out the rest of the rooms here, real quick. Oh, that's, that makes sense that the uh, basement storehouse key was in the O. Ah! No! Friggin' respawning enemies. That's why you use the melee weapon, save the bullet ammo. Yep. Oops. Well, you know, the AI missed, so that's not that. Because you don't want to have to fight, like, certain bosses with melee weapons. Yeah, no, uh, the, my, my strat is usually use melee weapon of choice for everything except for bosses, and then have a ton of ammo for bosses. Yep. And that's how brute. I, I was basic. I mostly followed that when I played Silent Hill 2, but that game is easy, so I had more mm. ammo than I needed by the end. That game is a lot easier bosses to beat with melee weapons, too. Wait, did I just come in here? Yes, I did. Duh. Uh, there are two bosses in particular I can think of where there's almost no reason to even use the gun. Oh, I need that. Ooh, antiseptic. Yeah, I really like the hammer. Does a In 2, I did like the faster weapons, but that game is... But that's also like... It doesn't matter if the weapon is a little bit weaker in that one, because it's that game is silly, and once you land the first melee blow, you can just stun lock the enemy. If they're not like a boss. I, I've just never been a. Uh, how to put it? It's not the speed of the weapon exactly that bothers me. It's the timing of the weapon, if that makes sense. That I'm particular about. Like when you uh, follow right, through on office. all the attacks and how like they time out. Yeah, just like how it. Like you have to press the button in a, with a certain timing to get that second swing she's doing. Yeah, yeah. Like I like the way this feel more or less. I. I I was defaulting to that explanation for things because it's like, how do I explain feel? But it's all about the way that that feels to me. Mm. Like a hitting with the hitting with the, it just feels good. All right, we need to go that save way. it. Is it this room? No. Yes. Yes, it is. Okay. All right, it's been 48 minutes, so we're going to stop. Uh, hopefully next time we'll get out of the hospital. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. Because the bill is way too high. Yeah. Sweating. <laughs>